Mounting a horse is a very vulnerable position to be in as a rider. A lot can happen between the ground and the saddle, so it's very important that your horse is comfortable and that they know as your partner that their job is to stand still while you are mounting. I start this process by getting Matador comfortable with the rope swinging over the saddle. I'll do a jumping motion to simulate getting into the saddle. He jumps a little so I reassure him that everything's okay and then I continue jumping. This process should be repeated until the horse is 100% comfortable. Once he is comfortable with the jumping motion, I make sure I have the lead rope handy and I'll put my foot in the stirrup. I step up without swinging my leg over and I'll pet his neck and then step down. This time when I step up on Matador, he takes a step and I gently ask him to be still with the lead rope while I'm still in the side of the saddle. This takes some coordination, but it's crucial in teaching him his part in the mounting process. If your horse has a habit of walking while you're swinging a leg over, you should repeat the half mount until they will stand still. Once the horse is comfortable and standing still, I'll finish swinging my leg over and sit quietly down into the saddle. I then try to sit in the saddle for a couple of minutes before asking the horse to move their feet. Horses are habit-forming animals, and many times they want to please us and will offer what they think we want. So, if every time we get on a horse we immediately ask them to move, they will start to anticipate the request and start moving as soon as the mounting process starts. By analyzing our own habits, we can make changes in our routine to make clear to the horse that their job is to stand still.